12 inches he's way more than 12 inches absolutely and uh we're gonna try to get three of them here let me rinse him off here just to see how big he is. That was funny. He's a big one too. Yeah, not a nice one. Get them all bled out. Rinse them off again? Yeah.
Fish cut, fish cut water. My fame. That's my fame. Woo! Good. Finally putting something together today. There you go. to fight Amanda's got to catch. <laughs> uh, I reached my limit of three which is probably all the fish we really need to do what we're yeah. going to do with tonight. Yeah. So do we really need to keep any more? Not really. But we're going to keep fishing here for a little bit. It is getting later in the afternoon. Found out the ticket today. The shrimp, sand fleas, no pompano, no whiting bite. Put the mullet on and we get the bite. And these crazy people are going back up through in the jet skis. They went down through hours ago. You get some kind of tour. Fun stuff. They're having yeah. a blast, probably. We'll get some fresh bait on. We'll get back out and see if we can catch another one. Is he on there? Keep it tight. Keep it tight. Keep it. 
Yeah. It's still there. Play the Keep the rod tip up. There you go. No, he's right there. Real. Watch his mouth, I'll bite you. He will? Oh yeah, they got the huge teeth. Very cool. Oh, nice. Another bluefish over 12. We're gonna keep this one too. This is another one we're gonna put in the cooler. We figured we'll get enough for two days. We're gonna have bluefish tonight for dinner and we'll have it tomorrow for dinner. So we'll get him, uh, we'll brain and bleed him. Nice size fish. Want to measure him? What's going to be that hook the tail? Yep. About 16? 16 inches, yeah. gonna play around here for a few more minutes but uh i think we're about done keeping fish we're gonna get this guy in the cooler on some ice and uh get back to the cleaning table get him cleaned up and uh, get him ready for dinner so i'll see you guys back at the house
remove a lot of the fishy taste from the bluefish. Some people don't even like eating them, which I don't know why I love bluefish. Um, I grew up eating them though up in Delaware. And you catch massive bluefish up there, massive. Uh, the bluefish down here in Florida are as about as big as what we caught today are gonna be the biggest. But I mean, the dogs love it. You trim this red meat off, I mean, they're ready to go. He'll literally bite your fingers to get, <laughs> to get a piece of that. You like that? So we got all the fillets done. That's nice. a nice chunk of meat right there. That's two dinners for us. So we'll be eating blue fish tonight and tomorrow night. And the dogs are about to go eat the neighbors. <laughs> so, <laughs> so. so we'll get these cleaned up and I'll see you guys back in the kitchen. Come here. You want some? You have to sit. Speak. Speak. Oh, they are speaking. Good job. Very gentle. Speak. Speak. Easy. What? I left all the ribs in that one. Oh, you figured it out. Yeah, that I need a bean. Good girl. All right, so we are in the kitchen now. Uh, we're going to be making fish tacos with the bluefish that we cleaned up, uh, at least half of them. Um, so I'm going to be making a sauce. So I'm going to be making a sauce specifically for the tacos, something super simple. I'm just going to whip up. Um, I got to run out here with the garden quick and see if I can find a tomato. So hopefully I got a tomato out here we can cut up. Bikes ready for bike week. Getting there, both of them. So that's this weekend. So I'm gonna be rolling up this weekend to do the bike week thing. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna fish while I'm up there. I doubt it. I think I'm just gonna chill and relax a little bit. I know it's dark, it's hard to see. Light on. We got some little guys there. Or this guy here might be decent. What's on this plant? Bunch of more cherries. Those are green still. So this guy's the winner. And boom, tomato. There's who's interrupting us, everyone. You can edit it out, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna whip up a quick sauce. Um, so we're gonna need three tablespoons of sour cream, or close to it. I'm not a big measurer. We have another one. Two mayonnaise. Half a teaspoon, or you can do a whole teaspoon of sriracha, whichever kind of heat you like. Um, we're gonna do about three quarters of one. <laughs> and a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. That's a half a teaspoon. Get that mixed up. And you want the consistency to be red. Well, not red, but an orangey color. 
If it's not orange enough, add a little more sriracha. Then roll out your lime. We're only going to use about half a lime, probably not even the whole half. That's going to be our sauce. I'm going to get the fish out. We'll get that seasoned up. And we're just going to keep it simple with that and just put a little bit of oil in the uh, cast iron and uh, sear both sides of it. And then it'll be ready to go. We're going to make some tacos. So we're just going to season it up with some honey garlic. The seasoning you can put on just about anything. We've got all the vegetables diced, tomato, onion, lettuce. And the fish has a nice season on it. Now we'll get some oil heated up and we'll get ready to, to sear it up in the oil. All right, now we're gonna put the fillets in our hot oil. Smells good already. All right, to the point where I, I want it to be a little darker on the on the sides. So we'll see how we're turning out here. Still not there. That one looks good. Yeah, that one's getting brown. That's kind of what we're looking for. We'll let it cook another three, four minutes on that side, and then we'll give them a flip again, see if we can get that brown caramelized crust look to them. That's the way I want them to be when I pull them off of there. All right, so the fish is done. We got the caramelized look to it, just a little, a little darker. We'll get these pulled out. And we're ready to make some tacos. So we got tomatoes, onions, lettuce. We'll squeeze.
squeeze a lime. Put yeah. Rotel on. Sure. A little spice. Got some Rotel chilies. Cheese. Never forget the cheese. All right, ready to give them a shot. That's really good. Really good? Mm-hmm. What's that one? Hmm. Cheers. Well, that's pretty much going to wrap it up. Beach day turned into some bluefish. Bluefish turned into some tacos. Everybody, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Until next time, I'm out.